Hey guys, it's Hope Melanin and I'm back with another video. I'm sorry I haven't been consistent on my channel, but I'm going to be coming to you guys with bangers after bangers because we're in quarantine. I have no excuse. So I'm going to be coming back to back to back to back. Wait, come on now. See, this is when you're too hype. I do sell lashes now. It's probably backwards on the camera, but... This is Boss Babe, and I am wearing Boss Babe. I don't know if you guys can really see it, but... And I'm also launching my lip gloss on Monday or Wednesday. One of the two, but I'm going to figure it out. Make sure y'all turn on the bell for post notifications, please, guys. So y'all can be tuned in each time I post a video. Tune in, never tune out, baby. Period, period. But let me stop talking and get right into the video because it's time like what am i waiting yeah you got that yummy yum that yummy yum that yummy yum yeah you got that yummy yum that yummy yum that yummy yum yeah 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 okay guys so we're going to get right into the video i'm trying to show you guys a full view of the whole thing but as you can see it's really not working out right now so I'm just going to explain it throughout the video. Okay, so I'm going to start with the right here. Right here, I just have my organza bags. If you're a business owner or plan on starting a business, you know how important these are because you need these, baby. You need these if you sell lip gloss, hairpins, anything that's small that could fit in here, you need these. So I use these for my... I will, I will be using it for my lip gloss, but I currently just use it for my hairpins because my lashes can't fit in these little things. But I'm going to show you what I put my lashes in in a few. So stay tuned. Y'all already know. I don't use the purple ones, to be honest, because my brand is like pink. I, want, I try to keep everything pink. If it can't be pink, I choose white or silver or gold. But I don't like mixed colors. Like I don't try to make it multicolored. So, I only use the pink ones, but I keep these in case, like, in the future I might run out or... Well, it'll be rare that I run out because I always restock and restock. But just in case, I don't know. I don't like throwing away things that I didn't use. But in here, I just have my pigments. So, this is one. These are called the Mika, Mika, Mika powder pigments. <laughs> You, you need these um, when you start your lip gloss business because this is how you get the colors that you want and everything. And I really like their pigments so far. I just don't like the sizing of it because I'm going to need to keep buying and buying and buying more because they aren't bigger than this size. Like I have to find a vendor or somewhere to get bigger pigments because I don't want to keep rebuying the same pigments. Like, And then I have my flavoring oils in here. Like... So, I use these because flavoring oils are definitely bomb for your lip glosses. You want them to smell and taste good. And I mainly use them for the smell because when you open Hope's Dollhouse lip gloss, you're going to say yes. That smell is bomb. Like, what smell is that? Like, I mainly use it for the smell. But it also tastes good. And I also have on my lip gloss right now. Y'all already know. It goes on so smooth. I put my hair clips that I sell in here. So it's also a good investment to get after all. And also my glitters for my lip glosses. I put that in there. It's cosmetic glitter. Um, I think that's all that's in there, to be honest. I didn't really fill it up, to be honest. Um, And I also got this off of Amazon, if I didn't say that already. Um... So we're going to get down to here. I have my lashes in here that I sell. And I have these tweezers in here. Because my vendor gave me like 10 tweezers. Like for free. I might have a giveaway soon. So I'm going to just keep them. In case I have a giveaway, I'm going to give these away with it. Um, She also gave me these bags. Over here I have my bubble mailers. This is the small ones that I have that usually you guys see when I ship out your orders. And then I just got these today. 
and I ordered them off Amazon. And they, let me tell you how the story about that tune. I ordered them off Amazon. I paid thirty seven, like thirty seven dollars, and everybody kept saying, "Oh, it was only fifty a bulk." But then when it got to my house, my mom is like, "Oh, guys, are y'all expecting a package?" And I'm like, "Yeah." And then when the package got upstairs, it was in this huge box, guys. A huge box. And I'm like, oh, no, that's not my package. Because my packages come in my mom name because I use her Amazon Prime. So I'm like, that's not my box, mom. You sure you didn't order something? And she was like, no. Because usually if it's only 50 bubble mailers, they'll put it in like a little box. And then, yeah. And then I pull it out. And why is there 250 bubble mailers in there? I'm like... I did not know I ordered 250 bubble mailers. The only reason why I was disappointed was because I'm like, where am I going to put all of this stuff? Like, literally. I have this space, and y'all not even seeing everything. Like, I soon um, changed the camera position so y'all can see the whole space. And then I have a space over there. And then I have, it's just like a lot. So I'm like, where is 250 bubble mailers going to go? And I'm ordering small right now because I'm still a small business. So I want to see how things go. But, I mean, it's not that bad because, you know, I won't have to order for a very long time. But I had to get the bigger. Actually, I'm going to show y'all. All right, so these are the bubble mailers. They came like this. The rest is under my bed, but they're in a plastic. So y'all don't got to worry about it not being sanitary and all of that. They're in the plastic, but they're under my bed. Because I have space under my bed also. Alright, so let me show y'all one. This is the size. I think this size was like... I think this size was 6 by 10 I'm not sure. It had to be 6 by 10 yeah. And I got it from Amazon, $37 for $250. That was kind of a good buy. I feel like it was a good buy. But I definitely needed these because I was only I only had the small bubble mailers that I just showed you guys. And when people order like three pairs of lashes, I have to literally separate them and like use two bubble mailers. It just wasn't looking professional in my opinion. So I had to get the bigger ones. Then I have these. Well, they're holographic, so I doubt that it'll really focus. But I brought these for the bundles that I'm gonna do when I launch my when I launch my lip gloss, lip oils, and lip scrubs. I'm gonna do a bundle. But I wish these were bigger, and these is the only size they have. But I wish they were bigger because I also want to do a bundle with lashes, a lip oil, and a lip scrub plus my yeah lashes, lip oil, lip scrub, and a lip gloss. But my lash boxes are way too big to fit everything in here. So then I have these um, organza bags. These are the ones that I use to put my lashes in because they are kind of big enough to put my lashes in. But the only thing is I can't close it like this. But it still fits the lash in. So I still use them. Because I don't think anything could fit my lash boxes in them. Like they're literally so big. In here, in this thing, I just have my lip gloss tool. It's not a lot in here because I also wash some. I wash some because of my launch that's next week. And um, these are my um, wand tubes. They are so cute, guys. So cute. I love them. And she also gave me samples. Like, there's a bunch of um, sample lip gloss tubes I have also. But this is where I put my wand and my squeeze tube. And here, these are my syringes. I use these to apply oil to my lip gloss, lip oils, and lip scrubs. So, this was a good investment. And I got these from Amazon. It was like $200 a pack. These are the tops to my squeeze tubes. I also keep that in here. I said that I use these to apply oil to my lip glosses and lip scrubs and lip oils. But I also use these to put on the top of the syringe to apply the lip gloss inside of the lip gloss tube. I, if you guys want a video on how you can find a lip gloss tube vendor 
and stuff. I'll make one like that, but I don't get my lip gloss tubes off of Amazon. I do want to try their squeeze tubes because everybody gets a bulk of their squeeze tubes. But I really like my squeeze tubes because I feel like it looks more professional because they have a silver top. Down here we have more. <laughs> more organza bags i will not run out of organza bags like if y'all knew how much bags of uh, how much of these bags i have y'all will be like girl i have so many of these bags and i got these from my vendor and then i use these to package my orders they're just um pink rose petals i got these from dollar tree girl if you're trying to package your orders and you don't want to do too much and you don't want to be too expensive dollar tree is your best bet because dollar tree has a lot of stuff that you can use to package your orders then i just have these bags in case i do drop-offs but because of the coronavirus i haven't really been doing drop-offs people have been doing pickups and i'm actually gonna show you guys my new branding for my um drop-off bags in a minute So these are, this is actually somebody's order. She's going, she's coming to pick it up later, but I love my new branding. Like, I love it so much. Okay, so I have my Versagel from TKB Trading. This is a necessity when you're making lip gloss, guys. Like, this is, this is the 5.5 ounce bag. Because I just wanted to start out a little, you know, to try out. So I have multiple of the 5.5 ounce bags. And these I ordered from Amazon. I didn't order it off of TKB Trading. Because I felt like I order everything off of Amazon. So And when I order off of different sites, the shipping takes too long and everything. So I definitely just ordered this off of Amazon. And it came in like two days because I have the Prime. And I'm, I also just ordered another one. But the three point no, not the three point five, the half pound bag. I think I I don't know, but it's definitely bigger than this one. I'm not even sure when it's gonna come because they have this whole thing going on, and then somebody put me onto a new lip gloss base vendor, and then I go in there and it's sold out because all the other YouTubers know about it also, so I missed out. But I soon have a bigger one for y'all. I soon have a bigger one. Then I have the rest of my lip scrub containers in here. I have the um spoons. Cause I feel like for me, spoons is a necessity when making lip gloss. Cause you need a spoon to mix up the base and mix up the oils and everything in one. So I have that with that. Then in the back, I just have um a bunch of lip gloss tubes and stuff that I washed already inside of a clean plastic. It's sanitized, so you don't got to worry about that one. My lavender, rose, and jasmine petals in here, along with my oils that I use for my lip gloss. And cinnamon and stuff for my sugar scrubs. I don't want to really tell you guys the ingredients, because I want y'all to come up with your own ingredients for y'all lip glosses. So I just keep my oils up here. And my lavender, the lavender and the rose petals and stuff, I got those from Amazon. And they're honestly like less than $15. Like I said, I'm going to link everything in the description. And I don't really have much up here, to be honest. Okay, guys, so that was it for the inventory haul. I am receiving more products this weekend, so I'll do an updated inventory haul if you guys would like to see that. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more. And comment suggestions for what my next Entrepreneur Life video should be. And follow my Instagram at Hope's Dollhouse. I'm going to just link it in the description. The shop, Hope's Dollhouse. I'm going to insert the link in the description so you can get your hairpins and your lashes. And depending on the time that you watch this, my lip glosses will be launched. But if you're watching this the day that I upload it, tune into my launch next week coming 
for my lip glosses and my lip scrub and my lip oils. Tune in, tune in. Make sure y'all turn on the bell for post notifications, please, guys. So y'all can be tuned in each time I post a video. Tune in, never tune out, baby. Yeah, you got that yummy, yummy, yummy.